where I'm filming right now. But I really wanted to do a what I eat in a day pescatarian version because I am pregnant. So I just finished washing dishes. But if you didn't know, I used to eat meat. I used to eat a lot of meat. I didn't care. I loved meat. But ever since I got pregnant or ever since like around the time I found out, I, I can't stand meat. I don't want nothing to do with it. So this is going to be like a little what I eat eat in a day pescatarian and I kind of have an idea of what I'm gonna eat today but some things I need to get from the store but if I don't end up going there we're gonna have to figure it out so it's probably gonna be like breakfast lunch and dinner I kind of snack a little along the way but not really I don't really snack that much now I mostly snack like late at night so I mean we'll see how today goes so I haven't eaten anything yet and I just made my coffee so I'm gonna take you guys along with me my coffee has just finished and this is the one I used today. I usually switch it up so each day is kind of different. But this is the one I got. It's vanilla bean cream or vanilla bean creme brulee. Lately I've just been drinking it warm. That's the way I like it. Um, I'm not really an ice person. Oh, this is dirty. Great. Um, and this is the creamer I've been using because this is the creamer I've been liking right now. It's the white chocolate mocha. And this thing is expensive. But, I mean, I kind of just go like that, and then I get a, hold on. I get my Honda Zen chopstick, and then I swirl it, and I just go by the color. Like, light like that is good. And this is my first time trying it with that pot I used and this creamer, so we'll see how it, it goes. Oh, and I babysit, so that is little Elena. So I usually don't finish all this coffee. Usually it's just like halfway and then I end up dumping it because then I forget about it. But it's just a little pick-me-up to help me get through the morning and clean and organize. So I haven't been vlogging it, but I've been situating the house. Ari's now in her own room and all of that good stuff. So I've been working really hard on that. And I'm going to make me a cheese quesadilla. This is what I've been loving in the morning because it's so simple and easy. So I use this. I buy whatever one is the cheap one. And this is the cheese I'm using. I'm just going to finish the rest of this Mexican cheesy. And then buta. Put the butter in the pan. Put the tortilla, cheese, another tortilla. Let it melt, flip, melt, eat. Oh, and then I top it with um, some top tail sauce. Which I will show you guys. But Let's see. It's, I feel like it's still hot. Usually, like, when I make it, I just leave it chilling by the Keurig until, like, I'm done cleaning or getting Elias food or situated. Like, usually I'll cook it and I'll do this, but I'm so tired. Last night I went to sleep late, and then I had to take Ari to school this morning, so. And it's still way too hot, so. Let's let that chill and make my breakfast. Here's that. I just used the rest of the cheese that was in the bag. So let's see if I can make this good with just one hand. And then I just push it down. Oh, and if you guys are a pescatarian or a vegetarian or a vegan, let me know some easy, delicious breakfast ideas. I've been having a really hard time. Let me, let me pull up the screen so I can see what I'm recording. I've been having, in the beginning of this pregnancy, I was having a really hard time with trying to figure out what to eat. So, so far, I'm 21 weeks, and so far, I've only gained 8 pounds. Which my doctor said is totally fine. It's because, you know, and I've been eating healthier. Like, in the beginning, it was a lot of vegetables, fruits, which it still is. But now I'm, like, learning to expand. But my my little pescatarian diet thing I got going on, it's really expensive. Because all I want is kawaii shrimp. Only kawaii shrimp. And king crab legs. Like, that's all I want to eat. Very expensive. And that's, that's that. I'm going to plate it, put some tapatio on it, and eat it. Like that. Breakfast is solved. Cheese quesadilla. And when I eat, a little fun fact, I need a drink. Like, I need a drink. And since my coffee is still so hot, I'm going to drink a Gatorade. A Gatorade. And have my breakfast. And I'll see you guys when I eat a snack or at lunch. I hope I don't get copyrighted by Disney. But I got Pog, Passion Orange Guava Juice, and last night we had I made crab cakes for the very first time, came out bomb. I actually copied um, Laurie Vitali's recipe, not to the tea because some things I didn't have. And then I added some of my own things, and then I drizzled it with sriracha. I paired it with a peppercini, got some rice. Um, I'm probably gonna add more later, but I'm trying really hard not to eat that much because I eat it like crazy. 
but yeah we had leftover king crab legs and I didn't want to waste it and I wanted to make it into something so I made some um, crab cakes this was for dinner last night so I'm just gonna have some leftovers and yeah let's do this this is my snack avocado with garlic salt and pepper Garlic butter shrimp made by Leaky. Here is dinner. I really wanted to put cabbage on the bottom, but at Costco they didn't have any. So, and I peeled off the heads. I don't eat the heads, but Leaky does. My favorite shrimp ever. I totally forgot to end the video, and I put makeup on, and I did my hair, and I didn't even show you guys what it looked like. But anyways, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share. I will be posting more. Here's Ari. I really want to post more of these, so if you guys want to give this video a thumbs up, like please give it a like. I'm trying to grow my channel here. Ari, you have apples all on you. Go wash your hands and stuff now. But yeah, I'm going off topic. But anyways, like, comment, subscribe, and share, and I'll see you in my next video. I have my own room. Bye. Bye. DA got that dope.